Thank you to Google Play Games for sponsoring this video. Mobile games, they're everywhere now. At first, they started off as simple arcade style games, but eventually, mobile games evolved into way different types of games. You see, the gaming industry realized, wait, everyone has a phone, and mobile games evolved into full-on experiences. It was no longer just these quick arcade style games, but more and more like the games made for PC and console. AAA developers have turned their games into mobile versions, and some of these mobile versions of games have more content than their PC counterparts, to the point that sometimes I wish I could just play these games on my PC and not on my phone. <sighs> Wouldn't that be nice? What's that? We eventually can? What? That's where Google Play Games beta comes in. Google is currently partnering with developers to optimize mobile games on Windows. That means some of the best mobile games can finally be played on a much bigger screen. So being able to play some of the best Android games on my PC screen is pretty nice. Also, this will mean that these same games can finally be experienced on a mouse and keyboard, which I definitely appreciate. And I know a lot of people will want this option for themselves as well. But if you're thinking, Macro, the point of mobile games is that I can play them on the go. Well, that is true, and you still can. But with Google Play Games Beta, you will also now have the ability to seamlessly sync, sim, seamlessly, ugh, seamlessly, <clears throat> man, that's hard to say. You can seamlessly sync and save progress across devices. So you can start a game on the bus ride home and then finish it on PC or vice versa. Google Play Games Beta will give you more freedom on how you can play some of your favorite games. I know some of you have concerns, Steven looking at you. So if you have any safety or privacy concerns from any of these apps, Google runs safety checks on all games to help keep you and your devices safe. If you haven't noticed, I keep saying Google Play Games beta because it's still in its beta at the moment. So there is a select number of games that have been optimized for Windows at the moment, but more will be coming soon. There is a wide variety of games you can play spanning from different genres like racing games, zombie survival, creating your own cookie kingdom with cookie versions of BTS in it. Oh my gosh, that's a thing? I never thought I needed this, but here it is, and I'm now complete. So now that you understand essentially everything you need to know about Google Play Games Beta, let me show you how some of the gameplay is for these games, shall we? So now I'm gonna showcase a racing game called Asphalt 9. Legends. And I'm gonna be using a freaking Porsche. Porsches are so nice, dude. If only I could have one in real life. Okay, so it's just telling me the controls. You use 80 to go left, right, and S is kind of to drift and break, and I can respawn in. Cool, because it sounds like I might die. Let's drive around the world to the ancient ruins in Scotland. That was my sad attempt at a Scottish accent. It wasn't good. <laughs> race goals. Win the race. That's a pretty straightforward goal. Three, two, one. Go! Going right, going right. Easy peasy. I'm taking the ramp, dude. Here I go! Woo! Oh, I did a little kick flick there. Oh, watch out! Ooh, it's like a choose your own adventure novel. Let's drift. Boom! Oh my god. So much airtime. My Porsche is being destroyed. Look how dirty it is. Ramp! Let's hit it for the finish! Oh, baby! I don't want to toot my own horn, or I guess honk my own horn, but I'm kind of the best driver out here. Oh, 4,200 credits. Nice. So it's really cool. You can do all these missions one at a time and kind of like level up and unlock more and more currency so you can get different types of cars. It's a simple game. Now we're going to the crayon launch. I mean, canyon launch. Just got to ram these cars out of the way. I don't think we're supposed to be driving here at all. I'm, like, I'm kind of destroying the entire infrastructure of that tunnel. Straight left. Let's go left. Let's go left. Oh, did I just destroy that car? That's why there's a respawn button. Okay, the more you know. I think we're in first place now. I think we can win this. Yeah, just nice little drift action. Here we go. Swoop. Finishing in style. Playing this on PC is honestly really satisfying. So if you're into racing games, Google Play Games Beta has this option for you. Among other options, of course. This looks really cool. This is happening while I'm downloading resources. I gotta make an ID. I like using my Google for this. <laughs> Kina, Orbia, or Cleef. I'm gonna go with Cleef because his name sounds like Leaf. Leave it to me. <laughs> 
should have said cleave it to me. You had an opportunity for a great bun and you didn't use it, Cleef. Ooh, I can customize my fit. Does it have my skin tone? It does. It's me, guys. I am Cleef. Everything began on this day. Normally you would use your finger right here, see in the left, but I'm using the WASD. W-A-S-D, baby! Yeah, the movement feels very good. It feels like it was built for PC. Fear not, Cleef is ready to cleave. <laughs> You just got cleafed. Oh, jeez. Why can't they just cleave us alone? This is why it's called Summoner's War. Here I go. Summoning. It's Gore. Oh, Gore the monkey. How do I get past these traps? Oh. Uh, oh, jeez. Nope. Nope. This thing is uh, this thing's a little big. Kind of got a lot of health. But, you know, I must lift the invincibility effect with Gore. Nice, Gore! Break that invincibility. Oof. Barely dodged that. We almost got him, we almost got him. He's 4% health, we can do this. There we go. Easy. Ah, just when I thought I beat him, he's got another form. My teammates with the dub. I love when it changes to animation. It's pretty solid animation. The music is so peaceful. The game looks so pretty. I grew up on RPGs like this, so it's just something I could totally see myself getting really into. Especially since I could play this on my phone right now. Like, this week I'm gonna be going on a plane. I'll probably download this game and play it on the plane. This is how the game runs on PC. It's pretty smooth. Google Play Games Beta has made it so that you could play games quite naturally and smoothly on PC. It's not just, like, a game ported directly to PC. It completely works with your mouse and keyboard. See how the buttons are mapped to it? The Q, E, 1, 2, 3, C. So yeah, shout out Google! In a world full of zombies, one YouTuber can take them all down with guns and bows and arrows and friendship. State of survival. So to keep our people alive, we gotta plant some food and stuff. It's a full-on zombie apocalypse, you know? I get it. Mm. There's some good growing land right there. Where? Where? Oh. A lot of mobile games require you to press a lot of things with your fingers and just having the ability to use a mouse and keyboard and just click around is like really relaxing. This turret thing is overpowered. I love it. Victory! And I unlocked a briefcase. What's in the box? This warehouse will be a great help. Probably won't even keep the rats out. I mean, I feel like in a zombie apocalypse, Willy, the rats are the least of your worries. There are a ton of farm type mobile games that you could play, but there's something really peaceful about farming for the sake of survival, you know? Put it again, zombie punk. Oh no, there's rival gangs? We have to help him. He's trapped. Oh no, he's on our side. I thought he was a bad guy. Oh god, there's a runner. He's got that sh movement. Frank is messing up these zombies. Ain't no zombie gonna get the jump on me. Okay, I mean, they did. Rusty wouldn't have needed my help, Rusty, but okay. I just feel like, hear me out, Rusty. In a zombie apocalypse where getting bit by a zombie could turn you to a zombie, maybe, like, not wearing a shirt is not the play. <laughs> Nor does he care about being shot. <laughs> look at him, look how he just tanks them. This is one of those games that just feels really chill to play on your PC setup, you know? Who would have thought that mixing zombie survival with taking care of your little town in a farming simulator would actually play pretty well? That gameplay was pretty dope, huh? Anyways, the beta is out right now for players to try. So if you're interested, click the link in the description down below to download it. Note that you will need to be running Windows 10 Plus with an integrated graphics card and a 4 Plus core CPU. Also, hardware virtualization must be turned on in your BIOS. And I know that sounds complicated, but look, once you're in the BIOS, go to the the advanced CPU core settings, then go to SMV mode, and then just click enabled. It's that easy. Google Play Games Beta will be adding more games and features in the future, and they will be listening to player feedback, like you. So don't hesitate to give constructive suggestions and criticism. They just want to make sure that the experience that you are having on this platform is a fun and easy time. Mobile games are pretty fun, so it's about time that we get to play them any way that we want to. So let me know in the comments down below what mobile games you would like to see added to Google Play Games Beta. I just want to know what my fans are playing on their phones. Thanks to Google Play Games for sponsoring this video, and I'll catch you later.